to death. Might actually sound okay. First time out the gate, for the first time in mm, ages. Or does it? <laughs> Sometimes it's very hard to tell. staticky issue I sometimes seem to have also just kind of sounds like my voice upon waking first thing in the morning so I think it's fine we're gonna run with it welcome back I've missed you desperately happy new year officially unless you're watching this in the past in which case how and tell me your secrets so, we are back around to the start of a new loop, and I believe what we learned through my completely pointless ramblings last uh, last session is that we need to be at the complex in the morning in order to perhaps divert the power. So let's race right there and see what we can figure out. I did want to check first. It does kind of look like my residium has been reset. The question I had last time is... At the start of a new loop, does your Residium get reset? However, the other thing that muddles the mixture there is that I died officially to end the loop. I didn't make it all the way through the loop and escape. If you escape, you might retain your Residium. But I did not. I did not escape. <laughs> oh well. It is a little strange that I haven't unlocked any of these. Do a little half turn, Colt. Yeah! That's the stuff. Alright. Hopefully we'll find some of those eventually. I'm not sure where they're hiding exactly. However, with no residium to spend, let us launch ourselves directly to the gods. Excited to be here with you all. This will also give us one more chance to redirect that hypes laser instead of kicking them like I did foolishly last time. It is such a pleasure to be playing this game. Yeah, I'd love to help, but do you really think you'd survive against all of us at the same time? Mm. big difference. Alright, we're back out here. There are so many folks watching the sunrise out there, it seems. Fair enough, Igor. I'm gonna go ahead and enter your side of the complex now. I've directly broken his wishes. Sorry, Igor. Alright. So we have plenty of folks scattered about the hillsides and valleys and such. While we're here, we may as well go ahead and ruin Igor's experiment. Get him to attend Alexis's party once more. Maybe we could practice again in the even time. However, I don't necessarily want to kick the hornet's nest and get them all right raised. Is that what they are? Hackles? I don't know. So I just need to get a field nullifier down there without being detected. How is that going to work? Probably going to be detected by that gentleman, if not this uh, overseer here. So appears to be some residium over there. However, this looks like the only real threats. So I guess all I can really do is start the party here. Only backup plan in place. In case of emergencies. I think 
There's one more down there somewhere that I cannot see from a window. But we won't worry about that. I also realized that I can just do this through the window instead of dropping down from the ceiling. That makes it a little easier. Whoop. So here are the field nullif that I need. Grab one of those to my side, though I'm not really sure if it matters if these are on your side or not. Just in case. Alright, so I gotta find that lever to disable his defenses. New messages, you say? Really? I don't think that's a new message, but I appreciate it. The psychotherapeutic crispness of the air. A lovely turn of phrase. over here like a bat, crouching maniacally. So all of the turrets should be on my side. Let's go ahead and hit the lever. We can start setting up a little defense perimeter here. Very impressive. <sighs> Again, I want it. Let's try just pressing X this time. There you are. Okay. So two of them are gonna come from there. I finally seen the sunrise. Except for you, who's still enjoying it. Good for you. So those folks are coming back this way. I'd better hurry it along. you know, do any of the work myself, but why? Why would I do that when I have turrets? Boop. Oh, is it too uneven? The terrain and such. Well, fair enough. Okay. Let's get this party started. Stumbling drunkenly, I don't appreciate it. Expecting that to rile them up a bit more than it seems to have. Ow! My butt from a great distance. How could you do this? It's a little low. I apologize, madam. like grease up my thumbstick or something. It's very twitchy with small movements. I don't think greasing it up is really going to help, but... Stop that. You're being a naughty boy. Get him! Hooray! I should be able to grab a field nullifier. One of the green ones. Personal preference. Get this all set up. Everybody's got a weakness. Mine is... right down the butthole. That's how you get me. Every time. Not what I wanted, but thank you. Where did it go? Did I shift it? 
completely out of phase with our reality. Hmm. There it is. <laughs> it's just the same color as the grass. I see now. Alright. Ruin Igor's day. Then we're back on the trail of Juliana. Carefully. Don't re spin the already spun dial. And stop. That ought to ruin his day. Good, good. So, the only thing I didn't search for quite thoroughly was there's usually a trinket or two in these areas. There's two containers at least. There it is. Don't want to miss my trinket or two. Hmm. Gotta beat the devil out of this brush. Later. Later, though. I know we've read this. Though I don't remember what it says. And therefore, I desire to read it again. But we haven't the time! drink it in one of these side containers. Oh, thank you, milk crate. Alright. Looks pretty clear. There is residium up on that hill. I shouldn't forget. We need all the residium I can get my greedy little hands on. Exhibit A. It's all over the place this time. We just need to race back to the power station. Hello, hello. So nice to he see you. I almost said hear you. So nice to hear you there. Did you have a good New Year's, Peter? I just hid in my apartment. Same, same. I didn't do anything at all except for hide in my apartment and eat cinnamon sugar donut holes. And it was a hell of a party, let me tell you. Just a hell of a party. Glad you survived into another year. It is so nice to see you there. And hear you. Alright, so this is usually where it gets a little proximity mine-esque. Proximity miney sounds a little weird. Who's screaming? Why are you screaming? I better go ahead and set up my fallback line again. There's a couple of dudes. There's a dude or two. Boink. Boink. Hopefully this here will be less crazy. No idea what to expect anymore. That is fair. I've long since dropped my own preconceived notions about the year being... Good. <laughs> Or anything at all understandable. But yeah, we'll make the best of it some way or another. I have faith. Why are you pushing and pushing? Stop pushing and pushing, I beg of you. I, mean, I guess I could just take it closer and I wouldn't need that much of a defensive line. Let's do that. Gonna go back for another one, but now I'm lazy. Now I'm so, so lazy. Don't, don't, don't. Oh no, you're behind my turret. How dare you? 
How dare you be behind my turret? Just in case. It's probably a little jam packed inside the laboratory area. Or control room. Not sure what it is. Maybe both. Hmm. A box full of televisions. That's nice for later. Come back to watch my stories. As the world burns. Leave this guy outside the front entrance for just a second. Meanwhile, I'm going to go on a kicking spree. <laughs> and the power station is open. Yes! We tried so hard during the afternoon last time to figure out how to get into the power station. It's just... It's open in the morning. You foolish little boy, you shouldn't have wasted all that time. So I don't even know if we need to go into the laboratory slash control room area. Wow, my voice is getting quiet. Maybe maybe try some air. Maybe put some air in your lungs. No? Okay. <clears throat> so this is what I've been looking for. And we now know we can access it probably any morning at the very start of the loop, which I will also take as a clue that it should be done in the morning. I'm trying to catch, like, the perfect area or district to go to at the different times of day. It seems like Updom for party night is the definitive evening. I'm guessing Complex may be our definitive morning time. Just in case. Hmm. Go ahead and grab this Resilium. Never know when we're going to get a rare legendary weapon. Do you know what helps with voice? German accents. Yes. This will put air in your lungs. Mmm. Why is it so saucy every time? It's just German. It's not like a... It's not a stripper. And yet... <laughs> Dear Associate, Once the loop is established, the team can shift its attentions to other pursuits. Foremost among these is accessing the Operation Horizon Generator Facility below the Loop Control Center, as it is housed beneath some extremely sensitive equipment. Ooh. Demolitions are not an option. I repeat, do not attempt to blast the power door open with explosives. You have been allocated a variety of tools. Use them. I expect this to be your highest priority. Those doors should be opened by sunrise. Regards, Dr. Venge Evans. Angie, you sound different. When you want the power station at the complex opened up this morning, or else. So is that why it's opened in the morning? Wenji insists, but then Juliana comes along later in the day and is like, nah. Kaiboshed. Fair enough. Yummy. What is that, exactly? Is it like a server rack? I don't know. It's 1963. I don't know if that's a server rack. It's a little small. So, we may be able to get a crank wheel. It may not be, like, attached to the machine up there, but I would have to kill a bunch of people to check, and I'm so tired. So tired. <laughs> this is precisely the energy I want to start the new year. I'm so glad. Welcome to the new year. Take my hand. We'll walk into it together. Alright, so it seems relatively quiet down here. I have to check the lower level. Uh, you sack of biscuits. I tried so hard not to too derogatory. Wasn't that hard, really. So there are a couple of folks. Good. We have our code. 
to divert generator power, let's try to clear things out first. The turn lists ahead. The turn lists are about to be behind. Turn it off back. Classic. You haven't read the fucking man. I try to lead them lead them into a sexy little trap. Sorry about your face. We're a little late. Anybody else? Anybody else interested? Do it. Do it, turret. Apparently not a very good turret position. But hey, it acts as a nice distraction. Acted. even aiming for you. Sorry about your head. Head. <laughs> Tried to say face at the same time. Your head. <laughs> Machete me. Ow, oh, how dare you have such good aim from a distance. With your tiny sidearms. Alright, I desperately need uh, fizz pop. Oh, so desperately. Oh, they got me. It's not a, not a very defensible staircase there for my thighs. However, there should be very few of them left alive now. Hello, hello there. It's so nice to see you. Good morning, my heathens, indeed. Pleasure to be sharing a cuppa. A cuppa what? Well, it's... Permanent. My taste buds cannot quite suss it out. Oh, that was like perfectly lined up the first time. I should have just trusted it. I should have just trusted him. Stop that bad, bad, nasty behavior, sir. Ow, what's happening? You're shooting me through the risers? That's hardly fair. Through the risers. I'll take that residue back now, thanks. I kind of think there's one more guy left alive. I'm not seeing and or hearing him. We'll find him. Stroll confidently into his ambush. Aha! Nope. Well, fine. Could go ahead and use another fizz pop if I stumble across one. I've been playing a little fast and loose with my survival these last two sessions. Maybe try to dial it in. Get his person. Are you looting for porridges? Necessarily seem like there's a connection point into that room. But I'm sure there must be. Some way, somehow. Alright. So, I'd better go activate the power diversion code and then maybe we can make use of these. into that other room. However, me, my health, my terrible aim. Free juice. Mmm, what kind? Granite? Passion fruit? I've always had a big passion for fruit. It's good stuff. Had that hack still worked through the closed door. <laughs> oh, 
Well, sad to end this delightful song. Whoop! You open doors. Go ahead, use your thumbs. I'm not opposed. my escapes. Getting old. Just pressing my butt cheeks against the glass. Glass. The metal. Scared me. Scared me and I went wild with the shooting. Anybody else? We good? Good, all right. There is, however, a... There used to be a field nullifier. I'm not sure what they're intending that to do to me. But I should get around to the back side of that sensor for scramble purposes. I'm gonna scramble your purposes. I went too early. Alright, just in case. There's a hole in the wall. What for? Heads up, okay. What now? What next? We'll take some small caliber rounds, thank you. Thank you. All right. So let's figure this bad boy out. I have to get back up here. I should also heal myself. That would be wise and kind. Door. Back up here and use the code that we found from. Boyka Station. You, you've wedged me. I'm wedged. Fine. Somehow Peter always chooses games with cool fonts in them. This is a very cool font, though I had nothing to do with it, really. You were on Kitty Comfort Detail most of the night. Liam was very brave, even though he's never had the orange cat brain cell a day in his life. Aw, oh, is it due to, due to fireworks and such? Celebratory bang-bangs? Hello there, Happy New Year, so nice to see you. Aria handled it well. I'm so glad. Your coffee may have Baileys in it. Delicious. <laughs> it is so nice to see you all. I'm glad the night was survived. The revelries accomplished. Peace and quiet occasionally obtained. So, station in the complex we know is just outside the door. I wonder how it connects perhaps to Wingy's area as well. We know that there's a staircase behind a second horizon door. The facility in Updam for Stad Rock and Coral's Bay. Yes, I remember that one on the dock. In Coral's Bay, I don't really have a good memory of this one, though. It might be that one that was, like, up above the car graveyard. And then Updam, of course. We've been by many times. So send power to the complex. But would this allow me to send power elsewhere? Oh. I mean, sure, we'll start there. Yes, perfect. So we might have always been able to open the complex door, but now we can send the power to anywhere else. If we're going to hit up dummy. Well, I guess we'd have to come back here. There's only four 
time periods throughout the day. We have morning, noon, afternoon, and evening. So I don't think this can be done in one day, because we would need to return to the complex to switch power. But there may only be three if we're already in the complex, and we can do this one. But we still need to figure out the generators regardless. Unfolded directive. Wally! Not that kind of directive. Dear Eternalists, one door opens, another remains closed. Based on the Horizon documentation, you should be able to reactivate and access the adjoining station by restoring no fewer than two of the generators below. So do that. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Wenji. So we need two generators online. No other interactable buttons and such. Boop, boop, bop, boop. me here, but I'm sure that's just because I have to pick a lever. Let's head back down to the generators, see if we can figure out how to get them online. No fewer than two, eh? Alright. Batteries. Gotcha. Batteries to start the ignition sequence. Where are you, batteries? Plentifully stored below the decks? Mm -hmm. I know they were singing about batteries in the adjoining room. <laughs> Surprise? Hi! Hey, hey. I'm gonna go back here into the health room real quick. Don't mind me. Go into the health room. And we do have a charger as well, so even if we find a dead, discarded battery, we can bring it back to life. Should probably have been watching where I was going a little bit better. But we, we live. We yet draw hideous breath. Interesting. Maybe those are so well protected by proximity mines and lasers because they have batteries? And if I trip one of the proximity mines, that battery will be destroyed. You okay? Arr, too low. Fine, you're not very flexible, Colt. Just put it up there like a rocket. Fine, we won't desecrate his poor, poor skull. Probably wise, Colt. Thank you. What's my favorite book, song, or play? I've always been fond of the Fifth Piano Concerto by Mara Kessler. What did I know I had to bring with me to Black Reef? Aside from my rather extensive equipment? Curiosity, I suppose. The anomaly presents a singular opportunity. Or an opportune singularity, if you will. Do I enjoy the spotlight? I haven't given it any thought. I suggest you don't either. I like Wenchy. Access is only the first step, however. We're going to get these generators. We're going to need to get these generators tuned up and turned on. And you've only got a few hours in which to do it. Leave the systems in the flooded storage area alone for now. Actually, given their potential for catastrophic failure, set up some security measures to discourage any bright ideas. And don't forget that without batteries, the turrets are just glorified paperweights. Thank you for the reminder. We could go back and get the batteries from those turrets. Hmm. We'll assess those generators on subsequent loops. Regards. There is a turret at the far end that would have a working battery. I don't want to run the risk of popping any of these proximity mines from a distance, and I am doubting I can swim, even though this doesn't look like the iciest of water. It's probably just as cold as every other pool I've dipped my toe in. 
to frostbitten effect. So I'm not exactly sure how we would get to the other side. Aha, nice. This leads back around to the side room. Good, good. It's all making sense now. What I could do very easily is race back out to the opening of the bunker complex and get the, the other uh, intact turret. On the way, we could check the turret that the Eternalists destroyed and see if it still has a battery in it, though I doubt it since they destroyed it. Or I could try to get across to this one, but it's mm, a bit of a Catherine Zeta-Jones situation here. And me in loose, baggy clothing. Well, ah. <laughs> and I can't, like, destroy it from a distance because I need it to be online. I see. Just like the water. I see. Stop trying to shoot me. I'm nice. I promise. Someone has to promise you that they're nice. It's, eh, it's probably not worth trusting. I wouldn't. Alright. So I guess I could shift. <laughs> That's the one power I always forget that I have. I'm like, how do I get across here without getting shot? Shift. Switch to it first, that's an important part. Ah, there's so many splinters. So many splinters in my bod. Lovely. So we can yank the battery right out of that bad boy. Go back the way we came. I wonder if the battery can shift with me. So, I guess you can just kind of run along this side where there aren't any proximity mines and boink boink. May have been easier, but I liked the way we Catherine Zeta Jones did. I'm proud of us. Alright, nothing I really need here. This and do not get exploded on the way back. That hurts the battery. Oop. So this will give us one generator. Is there any particular generator we should choose? Sending good vibes from the nest. Hello, hello. Thank you for these vibes. They're positively delicious. And Happy New Year to you. I love a good pillow for it. Yes, indeed. This discussion is going places that I enjoy greatly. Alright. Do they have any sort of... Hmm. Like, hey, I'm the one for Updom. No? Shy, are we? Fair enough. This is Power Station 2. Station one. Both have two generators. Doesn't seem to be an appreciable difference between the two. So I'm just gonna start where we entered. This is fully charged. I don't put in the charger. I'll do this one. Oop. Remove and reuse the battery. Eh? So that generator is running. Give this a little charge. Mm -hmm. It's very quick. 
quick. It's generating around 103 kilowatts, or whatever that denotes. Gotta get it up to 1.21 gigawatts. Now looking around, strategizing how to make a pillow for it. Good, yes. <laughs> Find squished around you like a backrest, but using the comfy thing. It sounds so comfy. I should yank some pillows in here. Or gently bring some pillows in. I shouldn't, I shouldn't yank them. Active. Lovely. So they said you need at least two. Is there a problem if I just... Excuse me. <laughs> Will there be a problem if I activate more? Is there a capacity I should not go past? Go capacity. I feel like Icarus. Maybe it's only two you can actually start. No, here we are. I'm just sightless in my old age. I see. Button destroyed. Hmm. Did I... Did I shoot it? In my sightless old age? Is that the problem? Maybe they just... They just don't want you to do these. Okay. It could have been something I accidentally... Shot. I was <laughs> furiously gunning in that hallway there. But the fact that I would have pegged both of them in one blast seems unlikely. And yet, it would totally be what happened. So I guess we'll need to wait for the next loop to see if we can activate more than two generators, but hopefully two will be enough. So, we now need to divert the power to the complex bunker. Then we need to divert it to a different bunker and decide where to go next. Let's go back up to the control room. Woo! Maybe don't make everyone sick. You're still in my way. And I can't collapse you since you're broken. Mm. There's a battery right here. Always was. Always has been. No, good to know for the future. I jumped across the icy laser chasm to get mine, but all right. So, activate the complex switch. Send power to the complex. Directed to the complex. Powering down. Interesting. Is there a shadowy figure going to skitter across? No? You promise? Let's see if we can get through here. Finally, finally. Access to another Horizon Bunker. It's been too long. Sweet. Tidevarva. Quarantined. For a second I was like, guaranteed. Nope. Should I... What do you call me? How dare you? How dare you? Hmm, it's a special gold. Hope that didn't mess up the audio completely. Stunning lighting effects in here. Mm. All this rebar? I like it. It's all their fault! Who... whom... Ha. I need more information. 
vague, saucy messages from the beyond. Always whispers. Eye of the storm. My heart beat steady. Oh, this looks nice. This looks nice. It's purple. I was hoping it would be, be better than that, but still, I like it. Actually, exactly what I'm holding now. Very mature of her. I didn't authorize this. Yeah. Yeah, you did, Colt. Just like the end of Doctor Strange Love. It was great. To Lieutenant Natalie Sobel, second science officer, tight of our station from Major V. Raznik, Chief Security Officer. So sorry. Checking my audio there. It sounded a little little tickly. Given the loss of our experimental ass sets, the captain included, during the anomaly incident, head science officer Pishtek has been relieved of her duties. They now fall to you. These responsibilities require you to be entrusted with multiple pass keys, including the one for the generator station's primary power governor. Mr. Governor, sir. Nice to see you. The required documentation is in the Horizon Archival Office near the gate in Updom. It will be shelved in bookcase one in the restricted document storage. Be prepared to show proof of identification. The military has put significant faith in your abilities and trust in your discretion, Dr. Sobel. Do not disappoint. So yeah, we we did get that. I guess this is this is the path for if you had found out how to get into the generator if you just happened to be in the complex in the morning time and strolled in here easy as glam. That would tell you how to get that 184 code from Updom, but we did it the other way around. Shove your scalpels these thin wet lines. For some reason that my, my brain is recombining all these letters into the filthiest, just the filthiest combination of things. that. Any other important documentation? Go, 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 go! Come on, go! This looks like it might appear in uh, Wenji's station. Pilot survival projections. Possibility of time dilation extremely high. Precise effect unknown. Days to centuries, or vice versa, assumes survival of initial contact with anomaly. Pilot provisions limited to emergency rations last lasting a maximum of one week assumes continued cognitive function. Pilot has been missing now for seven weeks, presumed dead, assumes a linear experience of time. How did I experience time? Was it linear? I think not. This looks like Wingy. I mean, I'm not seeing Wingy, but this looks like her station. <laughs> Just take a quick crouch here. Take a quick crouch position. Alright. 
So, what would I actually have to do in Tidevarv? Or is Tidevarv just a an intended precursor to Troika? It doesn't really seem as though there's anything I need to activate in here. But let me double check. Mm, how would I double check? I guess I just need to passwords is the purpose of this little quest. Because I'm trying to find the password for the second door in Troika Station. So I did not find a password here. And assuming we will find it somewhere along the other the other stations. Oh, Back to there. How did you how did you get past my perfect defense? Wasn't that good, is is how. Welcome, sir. So nice to see you. Hello. Fair to say? <laughs> I'm a little bit wild with the reloads here. Do pardon me. Do pardon. So. We have been to... Troika Station, which is in Updown, but it's not the one we divert power to. So we still need to divert power to Updam Fristad and Carl's Bay, in one of which we will find the password we seek. We may have to rerun this again tomorrow to try to catch all three of them. But let's just do it in sequence. Send the power to Updam. Remove power from the Yasin Station. Lovely. <laughs> oh man. Cult is classic. So, we race for the exit, try to keep our backside intact, and we're on to Updom to open up a brand new station. Slid down the stairs a little too hard. I kind of need some patches for the material on the back of my jeans. Wouldn't be the first time. Become quite a back of the jeans patch expert by now. Let me tell you. You slipped away into the tunnels. So the other thing we accomplished was to sabotage Igor's scientific experiment so that he will attend the party this evening. Maybe we, if we don't need the evening for bunker exploration, maybe we can take another shot at him and Alexis. That sure would be fun. All right, headed to Yasin Station. Don't get shot on the way. Don't get shot in station. What's up, Dom? Oh, not much. What's up, Dom, with you? Classic. Alright. Do you want to go there? I don't think I got anything... Infusion-wise, that we need to, uh, keep track of. So I'm just gonna... Just gonna jump right in. It's noon. We're going up, Dom. Charlie Montague is active. If we... Feel ourselves consumed with... Unlimited bloodlust, we could race over to his island and take him out again, but it's just a little risky. It's a little risky when we're on the bunker path. I am pursuing knowledge, not the lustiest of bloods. Just 
Did she? Did she let me? I'm inclined to believe that. And that some part of her actually wants me to arrive. At the middle of the complex machine, so that we may have a face-to-face -face and share a glorious cup of Earl Grey. I hope she doesn't invade me again. I'm so, so bad at defending myself when she invades me. Alright, so I gotta get to the other side of town. I can probably just go this way. Seems pretty clear of dudes out here. This time of day. And I may as well take advantage. So I could go through there. That's probably gonna be a little packed. Setting up for the band in the courtyard, etc. But it's basically right across from there. Right across from me, I should say. Maybe I can slip along the lower path. Or maybe there will be several people standing right there. Yep, there's several people standing right there. Let's go through the library. Just in case. Whoop. Espresso, keep me perked up. To perk up, you gotta percolate. Hot cup of coffee makes the perfect day. And we're in Yasin Station, the nerve center. Words from the mainland. No signal anymore. No more words from the mainland. Should I come back to this? Or should I let my curiosity dictate my yeah? Oh good, it's just the other entrance way. Good, good. Down, boy. Quiet inside, loud out. Cold as death. Twice as cold as it is. Wait, no, I got confused. What's this? Eyes only. To Major V. Rosnick, from Field Marshal J. Better and Berezin. Work on it. Victor, while we're cleaning house, I want to solve our little Sova problem. Leaks, sink ships, you know, loose lips and all. If we can't sell it to the brass, Find something that'll make the bastard want to go home. I don't need details, just make it happen. Sova. I don't remember having heard that name. No fan of the intelligence operatives at Sova Station. It's not a person, it's a station. Listen here! Sounds beepy. Original series Star Trek episode. Get me into the library. Nice. Nice, nice. So good keeping sense of these bunkers. As they have been my primary curiosity throughout this whole experience. Alright, so these are all just entrance ways. Heading further up. Scraping the sky. What do they call that? Uh, uh. No one's waiting for your call. Oh. Didn't have to hurt my feelings like that. Redact this. I'm going to sneeze.
But as instructed, I redacted it. Nothing happened. Oh, something happened, though, and it hurt my sinuses. Ouch. It's fine. We're fine. I don't see any documents. Recheck. Recheck the documents. Someone's taking a lie detector test, and they are not being honest. Lift off. No, I want to remain clothed. Meant to be here. Lift off was meant to be here, was it? Bear is in the bastard. Classified information. Moff echst o. Okay. Memorandum. Jürgen Beresen, Field Marshal, Operation Horizon. Subject, Rack Facility Security Precautions. As per your command, the Rakyatoplan... Rakyatoplan! Failsafe has been implemented. The vehicle's ignition will not fire unless Tidevarv's... <laughs> Tidevarv's instruments detect the anomaly has reached a sufficiently excited temporal state. Whee! Furthermore... Access to the rack now requires a three-part passkey. One segment has been assigned to Sova Station's Lieutenant Tobias John, and another to Captain Colt Vaughn. The final passkey segment is, and thank goodness we finally made it, Flamingo. Victor Rosnick, Major. All right, we have two out of three. We have Troika, we have Flamingo, and Sova Station will hold our last password. All right. I will remember that info well into my next loop and beyond. And I think we're done with Updom. So the question now is, can we return to the complex? Switch power to Sova Station, which I don't remember is the one in Carl's Bay or the one in Fristad. I don't remember. We can continue to take them sequentially. And then save one for tomorrow's loop. Oh, let's just go back out the way we came. Seems nice and quiet. Oh, Juliana, no. No, Juliana. He's already here. There's also other, other Eternalists that I have now made aware of my presence. Mm. Somebody's got to die. Please, one of you die. Juliana? My treasure? My sweet. Ah, no. That's not what I meant. I didn't mean shoot me in my ass while I tried to escape. Okay. I'm trying to get out there for some health without being ambushed by Juliana. It's probably not going to work. Health, yay! Put on a couple pounds, have we, Colt? Fair enough. We'll go around. That's what Daddy likes. Mm. Dear valued customers, Unfortunately, Fristad fish and chips will not be available during the loop due to the f dishes popularity prior to first day. Mm. Juliana, no. I'm reading about fish and chips. It's not the time. the weapon to be using at such a distance. <laughs> what did you slip on? 
Oh, foolish. Foolish of me to think I could survive to such a man as Juliana. Die. It's a nice ambush spot, too. She's learning. Hold still. I said hold still. Apparently that's just a very thick box of detergent I keep winging. En route to their faces. Go ahead. I don't mind. I mind! Suddenly I mind. Hold it! I beg of you. Is she gonna show up this time? There was a guy standing up there when I passed by the first time as he moved along. Seemingly. Second, I could have sworn that was Juliana waiting for me. Alright, I'm just gonna unlock the tunnels. Typically, I would love to hang around and take Juliana out, as we would have you know, a purpose to be here, but we've already explored Yasin Station and we could just leave. Please, Juliana, I beg of you. I have a family. Maybe. I don't remember anything. But maybe I have a family, and then you'd feel so bad about killing me? Come on. Think about it. Shut it. Nobody cares for your little gripes. Hmm. Can I shift down there without breaking my ankles? Probably not worth it. Sorry. Sorry to ruin your day. Right. You can live, Juliana. Because my love for you, it grows and grows. <laughs> Looking at this game, you feel mental pain from replaying the original Thief games that have no autosave at all. Ow! I remember those days. When you could lose a good four or five hours with a single mistake because you allowed yourself to become immersed by the story and did not manually save it. <laughs> I'm just now seeing this highlighted message. He asks, where's she gonna show up? And I still don't say it yet. <laughs> Alright. I could have, while we were in Updom, I could have gone into Troika Station and seen if the next door's password was Flamingo, and that would have gotten us a little further into the exploratory bits. But hey, we'll get all the passwords first. No big deal. So I'm gonna see if I can go back. Ah, they've probably locked down the power station by now is what I've forgotten. I was like, we can just go back to the complex, switch it to another bunker, and keep exploring. We'd probably have to wait until the next day entirely. Which we could do. We could hold to wait until evening, and then I assume hold to wait until morning. And then go to Sova Station, or whichever station is in Fristad. However, that seems a bit wasteful. I don't really have any other plans. If we don't do that, this is what I'm most focused on. So we could collect some trinkets. But, mmm. Mmm. The other thing I don't know how to do yet is try to get Winji to attend the party as well. 
if it is Winji. It may be someone else. So, let me try something silly. I'd wait till evening. Just because I haven't done this before. Wait until the next morning. Lovely. You've made it through the day. Choose what you want to infuse. Nice that they give you the option. Mm, I'm fine with the common level limp 10. Thank you, though. I don't really, really need any of these. But I'm just gonna lose them. I mean, it's just wasteful. So, so wasteful. So let's check now, at the very least, do we keep our 17,000 Residium into the next day? You get zero, zero for sacrificing that, but all right, I'll just discard it, I guess, just to really stick it. May as well go for all of these as well. got like three slabs off of Juliana, but we didn't get to infuse them because we died, did we? Or did we infuse them before the evening? I seem to remember getting like erase and such. So maybe we're fine. Alright, 25,000. Let's check if tomorrow morning we still have 25,000 or if it does not work that way. Alright. The loop begins anew. The beach embraces my cheeks. Warmly. <sighs> so warmly. Alright. Uh, 3,500. So yeah, you do not, even if you sacrifice and even if you survive all through the day, you start again with 3,500. Fair enough. We'll have to make all of our infusions during a single loop to make the most of it. I never did. <laughs> I completely forgot. Because I got so excited about the generator to go to Winji's station and try to free the Halps. We should do that this time. If it doesn't put us in too much danger. But, this time I will want to send it to Fristad, and then we will go explore there. Just have to survive the rather hefty amount of guys down in the bunker. It's often my plan. Get this asshole. Get this asshole? What? Wh what could that possibly mean, Juliana? Alright. So we could mess up Igor's day again, but if we're, if we're just worrying about bunkers, we probably won't end up attending the party to see that through. So I'm just going to try to slip on past. Easy does it. Easy peas. We now know that there's a bunker on the chair. Not a bunker, a battery on the chair right at the start. Should be the easiest way to get our generators running. We need to kill everyone regardless. So we have a nice easy time of it. You're about to pick up pizza? You're gonna share it? Share it with my mouth. It's a weird way of saying it. But do. Okay, I'm not helping. You are not helping the situation, sir. Is there a second? Active turret down here that I just walked right past. It's not active until later in the day. Fair enough. Come on now. 
Alright, I'll stand up. Glad they didn't hear that. Alright. Probably gonna come back to bite me in the ass, since now they can just flank me from behind. Is that how flanking works? Yeah, from behind. I think that's fine. So we just need to get battery into the generators again. I guess I need to put in the code every time, sure. Not a big deal. Lovely. Does this look broken? Oh, thank you for the link to the Sewell place. There's the battery we will be needing. That uh, turret really didn't help me at all last time, so I guess I might as well just do the same thing, but Song's turret. Come up the stairs at me, but don't shoot me through the risers this time. That hurts my feelings. Machete me either. In the face and or backside. It's not where I appreciate best being machete What? Where I appreciate best being machete is on my home theater system. Starring Danny Trejo. I will take any excuse to mention. Going to be a bad situation. Don't lay down any fire. No, don't do it. Through the risers? Ah, oh, I've become just like them. That's a really good use. Every time I have a trinket, it's like, slowly regenerate health. I should start keeping those. Start keeping those trinkets. I want to catch. I saw someone shooting me from up here. But maybe we took them out. Die. I beg of thee, die. Embrace the sweet release of death. No health once again. Alright, back up here. Up here, no health remains. Mm. Mm. Thank you. All right, down we go. Yes. Can I help you? Something else. I hear you. I hear you. The long thing. The stairwell. Good. Oh, wow. Alright, that was a little messy. Maybe we could be better at that next loop. But hey, grabbing the battery, make sure there's no one who's going to shoot me slash the battery. This is wise to double check. Alright, gonna risk it. Get that pace kit. Mm, some brisket. Stop just rhyming things. Stop. I'm hoping it's going to be safe in here, but I'm, I'm going to put this gently to the side in case it's not safe in here. Oh, good. Oh, good. Plenty of health. 
health. Restore our ammo. Thank you, storeroom. You are a, mm, such a lifesaver. Alright. Got the battery. Popping it in. Button destroyed. Oh man. <sighs> so I need to be a little more careful about where the battle takes place here. I'm going to have to hope we can keep one of the other generators on the far side active, or we're going to have to start this all over again from the morning time. So I cannot let them shoot it, and I cannot shoot it myself. But I also need to kill all of them and clear the room. There must be a way to, like, stealth it. Stealth it upright proper. Let's get to the upper level first. I had a nail gun for situations such as this. Alright, that doesn't seem like it's gonna be a good way to go. Let me try working around to the other side. Since we already took out the majority of these folks. I do wonder if any of these are, like, usable, though. Due to their placement and relative disrepair, I had assumed not. But if neither of them are destroyed, this would be the... the way to go. And they seem relatively intact. I just have to take out the turret. Which, since I already have an active battery... ...worry too deep. So it does seem quite well armored. Do you have a weak spot, or...? Nah. There you go. Alright. So while the battery is well and truly safe, far from my shenanigans and antics, let's try to take these out. Go pop pop. Right. We don't have to worry about the turret, so I can go onto this side now. Battery socket. Does it? No lasers on my head, good. Okay. Does this button seem like it would work? Yeah. I, I don't I don't see a problem with it. Let's try. It'll be way easier than having to clear out that second room. Nice that they give you options. Or well, potential options at least. Did I leave the battery? Storeroom? Yes. Thank you. All right. I guess the idea here would be that if you can do it quietly enough and not destroy any generators, you could turn them all on. And then... <laughs> no, I got excited with myself. You'd still need to come back to the complex to switch the levers. But maybe there is enough power, if you get all the generators on, to switch the levers at once, and then you would not have to return to the complex. That seems like it would be possible. And then 
you would only have to come to the complex in the morning. Make sure you're quiet enough that you don't destroy any generators to turn them all on. And you could get to all of them in a single day. But I don't think necessarily you have to get to all of them. In a single day, you just need, like, the password, the flamingo, from that one, and then we never have to go back there again. As far as I know. So that should be enough power to get me to Sova's station. I don't really need to worry about the other ones, but while I'm here, I'm gonna see if I can get into that secondary generator room, try to take some of them out silently, just for the practice, and leave this bad boy in the charger until then. Naughty boy. All right, back around. Two hundred sweet, sweet juice points. So let's be nice and quiet now. Don't upset Grandpappy. He's sleeping. field nullifier. I don't think that would do anything for me. It does act as a nice distraction. You fully saw me. Fully. I don't want to really shoot towards the generator in any fashion. If I can prevent it. Those two, though, they can die. So you're not near the generator at all. Did you just throw something at me? Was it a sharp cookie? A ginger snap? You're not shooting the generator, are you? Stop shooting the generator. Big ass pepper mill. That makes two of us. Now that makes one of us. Right. Hope nothing ricocheted. Should still be relatively intact. Nobody else waiting to ruin my day. Good, good. That is a nice pepper mill, I'll admit. I'd like to grind on that any old day. There is another battery up here. Curious. Curious that they didn't find it. I guess they were making up songs about finding it rather than looking, so... Generous instructions. Dear Eternalists, place a battery in the socket to prime the generator before starting it. Afterwards, the battery may require recharging before it can be used again. You do that at the recharging station, you simpletons. I don't expect any questions. Nor should you, Wenji. You've explained it perfectly. Alright. Sure, I'll take a little health. Thanks, thanks. I already have a battery ready to go, so I think I'll just leave that one. Any other documents? Recordings or woe? years ago, I came upon some notes, some documents, recordings, and woe. Oh, I am Graham Kersner, hiker, world traveler. 
I've seen the corners of the earth. Thank you. This is good practice. You dropped it. Slip it in there you go. Gently. Gently hit your mark. Lovely. It's broken. There might be one more working back in the uh, watery section. I think that basically proves the theory I was after. So we're at 400. Try pulling multiple levers, see what happens. And then we will know everything we need to know. I can't remember if they put some, like, Guys around, new guys, after you activate the generator or not. Seems safe. So, we did Updom. Let's do Fristad. If we have the power for it, Sova Station is in Fristad. Great. Let's do Carl's Bay as well. Perfect. So you can absolutely do multiple bunker doors in a single loop. Provided you don't blast the holy hell out of the generators first. Good to know. So, we need to head to Fristad. Try not to be attacked as I'm leaving. Eh. Well, that's gonna be my mental soundtrack for days. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I brought it back up. we got here. Did we go across this guy's little roof? Yes. I know I've taken out very few of these guys, so the safe paths are narrow. Back we go. Thank you for your time. Complex, I appreciate you. I cannot wait to get into these last two bunkers. We should find the password we need in Sova, and I'm not sure what's in a car station. But I'm looking forward to it. Perhaps another password based on those descriptions. A little bit better attention to my trinkets and see if there's anything that replenishes my health. Regenerate more total health. Carry loads more ammunition. Sounds pretty great. Your mines and grenades are medical marvels, significantly healing those that they hit. So I could just like... Sounds nice. I take that. Check. Weapon trinkets, just in case. Accuracy of aimed shots. I'm typically aiming. Let's go for it. Give my friend a little boost there. We need to infuse those if we want to keep any of them. Sofa Station, Carl's Bay, happening in the afternoon. Okay, so this will work out great. We should be able to hit both. Just don't die at Fristad, and you'll be able to hit both. Well, your previous brain music was the Dark Dice musical, so... <laughs> Just switch back and forth. A new musical for every day. That's our inevitable goal. We never did have a Liberty musical, did we? It's hard to rhyme things with Sylvanas Claire out, I guess. The first time. Yeah, you actually escaped the island back in the 50s and then volunteered to come back with us. You just couldn't stay away. You love this place. <laughs> <laughs> yep. 
You're gonna burn. Ow! Why? What did I do? Besides ruin everything. I'll take that, thanks. Alright, so I don't really remember where the bunker entrance is. But if this is the car yard, I think it might have been above this. So let's head this way. I'm sure there's a better word for it than car yard, but here we are. Ow, that didn't look like a good angle for you. That was not your good side. Stop looking at me. Worry about proximity mines out here. It's the only thing I remember about the car yard, but then I think it's that door. Should be the horizon station. I can't really afford the noise of pop popping any of these either, so I have to do a lot of snooping through the tall grasses. Sounds very close to me. It sounds so close as to be a significant problem. Just out of curiosity, I can't hack mines, can I? No, no. Just out of curiosity. All right, so this one there, this one there. Proximity along the far ridge, but I would love to just make it out. And then there's an active turret I will need to get behind once we get further up. I guess I could shift if needed. I'm just gonna risk it. Hug that edge! Hug that edge so hard. Don't get detected. Don't you do it. one right there. I was about to jump across. Okay. No thank you. No jumpies. This looks relatively clear. I'd love to get that turret on my side and then give him a little welcome present. Welcome present. Juliana, no! I'm on a- we don't have time for your shenanigans. We don't have time for your shenanigans! That <laughs> worked out surprisingly well. Sorry she got caught. Cliff edge. A little bit loud, but hey, take it. Ow, oh, no! Bad monkey! Thrusidium, I love you. Bye. Bye. about in a moment. No longer drains your power when you're not moving. Visibility forever, as long as you stand still. I'll take it. So, was this the door? Now that I'm here, this is looking very plain and ordinary. This would lead down to Thea, Thea Zabroska's artistic studio, and I don't want to activate her. 
So thank you, but no. That being the case, where is Operation Horizon? Sofa Station. I'll head that way. I was desperately misguided in what I thought might be the balcony we were looking for. But that's okay. It was fun while it lasted, and we took out Juliana. Should be safe for the rest of our time in Fristad. I very much want to shoot you, sir. You're just... you're just flaunting it. That's not wise, but he was just flaunting it. Missing significantly is not helping. Aw, oh, truck. Why would you do this to me? Gonna need more ammo now. not large caliber. Hmm. Explosive. Why are you so quick? Don't make that, make that face at me. <laughs> what are you gonna do, shoot me? You saw me just equip a sniper rifle, right? Your eyesight isn't that poor. Okay. No, no reason at all that I've been killing all these folks down here. No reason at all. Let me find some small caliber rounds. Double check I didn't walk right past any up here. Shotgun shells, sure. I guess I can take the turret with me. Because the ammo is scarce. I don't always do that. Just hit X once. There you go. Easy does it. Some time later, all right. Sweep this area for mines, as we have not been up here yet. I'm sweeping, I'm using my eyebrows, and I think we're going. Let me know if you hear beeping, followed by a sudden explosion and my girlish screams. Well, no, we found one. Guess I'd better unlock the tunnels before I lose my opportunity. Go ahead, squeeze on through there, Gold. Squeeze on through. You can make it. I believe in you. Hey. 
It's absolute chaos, but it's going well. Good God. On to Sova. Also, do you have any small caliber rounds? Hmm? Hmm? Anything for Poppy? Small caliber rounds for your father? No? Check back in this room. So many large caliber rounds. That's not what Poppy needs. Oop. No ammo? Really? This whole table space, all this room, and no ammo. Fine. So where did I leave that briefcase? <laughs> I know I had it a moment ago. There it is. Like, I didn't imagine the briefcase, right? Forty meters down this way. Couple of, couple of party goers. Turret down there for me to attempt to steal. I wish I had like a blowgun that had hacking darts on it. That'd be nice. I don't want to destroy that turret. Hmm. Hmm. They are all looking this way, though. Set this up high, somewhere I can see most of them. Oh! What happened to you? We good? Stop it. You're being rude to the turrets. They tried so hard to impress you. Alright, okay, even got some small caliber rounds out of the deal. Hooray. Check right here. What were you holding? Nothing? Just a machete? Alright. So, here... Sorry, too curious. Uh, oh, here is the horizon door. Putting that in my mental vault for later. My mental vault has very poor security. Could easily be stolen from by George Clooney and a tight group of friends. Shove off, John. That sounds... A little presumptuous. Never used to come here, breezing in on it. Barrison. <laughs> You're not breezing in on it. That doesn't even mean anything. Barrison is in on it. Question mark. Type 4. Supplemental report. From Sova Station to Bureau Desk 17. My favorite Bureau Desk. Subject Operations Officer. Since submitting our initial report on compromising factors in Subject Longshot's personal life, it has come to our attention that his paramour, Subject Scribe, is with child, conceived on the island. The pregnancy is in its earliest stages and not yet visually evident, though its veracity has been independently confirmed via the infirmary. There is no apparent impact on the viability of the pregnancy from exposure to the anomaly, but further observation is warranted. By the subject's account, she did not inform Longshot of her state prior to his disappearance. Sova could not corroborate this independently. Recommend Scribe's reassignment. Who is Longshot? 
sounds like a code name you would give to a pilot. And we know that the pilot is me. Did I have a paramour on the island who was with child? Roughly 17 years ago. You trusted them. Screw your secrets. I kind of want this. I kind of want this. I don't want to replace a weapon I already have, though. But I kind of... I find so much shotgun ammo, and I can never use it, and this would just be... This would just be great. I guess I more often use the pepper mill than I do this. And we know it's infused, and I can pick it up in another loop anyway. I'm gonna hang on to this bad boy. Mix it up a little. Always listening. Filled with worms. Gross. I'm not going in there. I'm not going in that door. Every grin a mask. Classified information. Peter. What is it feel called? Finish your sentence. Berezin's cleaning house. I've been reassigned to the mainland, ostensibly for hiding the pregnancy of Colt's main squeeze, Akar Station's very own Lila Blake. Isn't Juliana's name Juliana Blake? So congratulations on your promotion. The rack is accessed by way of a multi-stage audio lock. That senior officer speak for just a whole mess of passwords. Yours is wicker work. Sexy. The other passkey holders are Head Science Officer Pishtek, or whoever replaces her, Field Marshal Berezin, and Captain Colt Vaughn, MIA, since the experiment. Don't be nervous. The bird has a fail-safe. It'll never leave its nest. Can't put more in writing, but I'm sure you'll do fine. Wicker work. Flamingo Troika. I am in good shape. That's what I was thinking, Colt. <laughs> I guess when you... When you completely abandon your daughter and go to a mental institution for 17 years... She she grows up to murder you, is, is what we're learning. What we're learning about family dynamics. Fia Zabroska's hideout. I don't want to walk right into there. Not in such a... such a delicate state, emotionally, with this news I've just heard. And let's just close that back up there. Great. To Bureau Desk 17 from Sova Station. Increased reports of confusion and disorientation, lost time, confused memories, and so much emotional instability. Mm, fine. Anyway, back to business. Confirmed via infirmary records. Command seemingly unconcerned. Trial schedule unchanged. Request further direction. Anomaly has all but disappeared since the trial. No further discernible impact on local temporal state. Berezin finding it increasingly difficult to justify Horizon presence on Black Reef. Remote monitoring possible, reassignment likely. Are they monitoring us from off of Black Reef, but how? Wouldn't that mean hundreds, if not thousands of years are passing while they're monitoring Black Reef? Just watching the same day play out over and over. It's a good job. I just don't understand the how. All right, so I should try to get to Akar Station purely because we already did the generator work to achieve it. However, our next step in the quest line proper would be to get back to Updom, to the rack, and enter in all three passwords. I am desperately excited about both of those possibilities. But let us first try to survive getting out of here. Back past the proximity mines. If possible. I hear you beeping. I 
I hear you beeping, you son of a beep. That's not a place to stand. There are some trinkets right there, though. Mm. Delicious trinkets. I guess no one's, no one's left alive, really, so let's just... Anyone left alive? No? Good. Trinkets, trinkets, trinkets. My favorite time of day. Close. to remember to infuse the ghost ether upgrade we got from Juliana. I actually got something for once. Just because I'm a terrible person and he's unawares and goose pimply. Yeah. Not gonna pass up that opportunity. Coming up on two hours just now, this might not be a bad time to stop, but I feel like we've finally just achieved the means to actually get some cool information. Or to try to take out the real Giuliano, or speak with the real Giuliana, depending on how it goes. So I would hate to end it here, and yet I should probably race off and find some lunch and get back to my editing. However, the good news, the silver lining, is that I actually do have tomorrow off as well. And we could probably do another session of attempting to speak with Juliana tomorrow morning, if not earlier. So I will... More stream, please! Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> it has been such a pleasure to hang out with you guys. I will try to infuse these real quick before we race off. It's now gotten very snowy in the afters noon. Infuse slabs. Slab upgrades. There it is. <laughs> good, good. All right, ghost is the only one we have not already infused. Go for it. So, that being the case, I guess I also have to equip these. I kind of thought they did automatically. Foolish. Foolish to assume. We'll get airborne on our shift, and then I'm using Nexus, which has been quite helpful. Do I have any upgrades for Nexus? No. Alright. So, we will be back in the afternoon to try to go to Carl's Bay and search Akar Station. We already have all the passwords we need, so I'm not sure what we will learn there. But if the bombshell revelation of Juliana very likely being Colt's flesh and blood is any indication, I'm sure we're in for some fun times. Can't wait to see your secrets, Akar Station. Dress them up sexy for me, would you? It is a pleasure to catch you guys. Happy New Year. Happy 2023, officially. Oh god, how? Oh god, how? And I will see you very soon. Hopefully tomorrow at the latest. Goodbye for a bit. <laughs>